in these problems we're being asked to evaluate some algebraic expressions and what I mean by an algebraic expression is something like this where you have numbers and letters and some mathematical symbols so here we have 8n minus m luckily they've told us what m and n stand for m stands for 4 and n stands for 6 so we can just replace the n and the m with this uh, 6 and this 4 the only other thing I think you need to know is that when you have a, a number right next to a letter, that means those two are multiplied. So when I put this 6 in for n, this will mean 8 times 6. So let's see how that goes. So we've got our 8, and then for the n, I'm going to put in 6 and remind myself that this means multiplication when they're right next to each other. And then I've got a minus sign, and then we've got 4, which goes in place of m. So there's our problem. We need to go ahead and calculate the rest of this. We should do multiplication before subtraction uh, based on the order of operations. So 8 times 6, that's 48. So this is 48 minus 4, which is 44. So we've evaluated that expression and come out with 44. Let's try another one. Uh, this one maybe looks a little bit more complicated. We've got h minus 42 over g. But we're really just going to do the same thing. We're going to take these, these numbers and plug in 44 for h and 7 for g. So let's rewrite this. Instead of that h, I'm going to put 44. And then there's a minus sign. And then we have 42 over, and instead of g, it should be 7. OK, so we have 44 minus 42 over 7. We need to do this division problem first. This is 42 divided by 7. That's 6. So this is 44 minus 6, which is 38. So that is how to evaluate algebraic expressions.